Hello, welcome to the BMC Learning Series. Today we'll be covering Main View for Kicks Basics using the 3270 interface. Main View for Kicks is organized into separate data collection, online, and offline components. The data collection component gathers and retains the performance information that is used by both the online and offline components. You use the offline component called Performance Reporter to create printed reports from the historical data saved in Main View for Kicks datasets. In this session, we'll focus on the online services and learn how to examine the status and performance of our Kicks regions interactively. We can choose between two different user interfaces, a 3270 standard interface or a web browser GUI interface. For this course, I've chosen the 3270 interface. Let's start from the Easy SSI menu to examine various views by placing the cursor on a field and pressing Enter. Fields that have a leading dot take you to a view containing data. Fields that have a leading greater than sign take you to an Easy menu. Let's select Analysis Table and see the C Region view. C Region provides a performance analysis of each Kix region within the current context. In the C region view, we can see several indicators that represent the status of the Kix region, including total CPU, CPU percentage, EXCP rate, max task percentage, transaction rate, average response time, and more. Personally, I prefer the real-time version of this view, called C Region R. We enter the name of this view, C Region R, in the command field and hit Enter. By default, we work with a context of all. This is a predefined context and shows all subsystems of the specific type. In this case, it means all kicks systems. To zoom in on one kicks, you can enter con subsystem name. No additional context definition is required. In this example, we will enter the command con C-A-G-A-A-O-R. And now we see only one kicks, C-A-G-A-A-O-R. In addition to the predefined contexts like all or cursus, you can define your own context. For example, you may want a context of all test Kix regions or all application owning regions. Most Kix environments have dozens or even hundreds of subsystems. Main view single system image functionally makes it easy to see all of the subsystems at once or see a group of subsystems at once. We have previously defined a Kix AOR context to group the Kix applications regions. Entering the command con Kix AOR, we see two AORs, application owning regions. Let's go back to a context of all, where we see all subsystems. Press F11 to scroll to the right. The weight is used to order the Kix systems in the C region R view. So the subsystems with problems are at the top, and normal subsystems are at the bottom of the list. The initial value for weight is 1. Every severity message increases this message by 64, and every warning message increases it by 1. Subsystem CBGM has one severity message plus one warning message plus the initial value of 1 for total weight of 66. Subsystem CBGM has one severity message plus one warning message plus the initial value of 1 for total weight of 66. We can hyperlink on any count field to see the messages. We see the region CBGM suffers from two problems. A severity message, displayed in red, shows the Kix is over the defined limit of 65% for Kix private storage in use. A warning message, displayed in yellow, shows the transaction PET0 has used more than five CPU seconds. This leads to the next question. 
Where do we define these limits? We have a dialog available. From the Kicks SSI menu, hyperlink on the Administration menu. Here we select the responsible paths by hyperlinking on the target name. Now we drill down on problem definitions. On the CMR PRBT view, we change into edit mode by entering edit on the command line. Now we can enter the line command change to reach the dialog where we can edit the problem threshold table. In the first panel, we can determine the target kicks. As you can see here, wildcards like asterisks and plus signs are allowed. We can define common thresholds for all kick systems, but you may want to define different thresholds for different kick systems. We can exclude transactions or files. For example, we can exclude long running transactions. Type next in the command line to continue setting parameters. In the second panel of the dialog, we can change the values by simply overtyping. After making the changes, press F3 to save and exit. We save the changes by submitting the primary command save. You can activate the new problem threshold table dynamically by entering the reset command or by entering the line command PRL in view CREGAGT. Main view for kicks provides a dashboard view that shows key performance indicators in traffic light colors red, yellow, green, and in reverse display. When a column or field is highlighted, it means there is a defined hyperlink to go into drill down mode on that resource. This is a rule for all views. Placing the cursor on the max task field for kicks CAGA and pressing enter, we have the list of transactions in execution. That concludes this session on main view for Kix basics using the 3270 interface. For more videos on main view and other BMC solutions, please visit our BMC mainframe YouTube channel at youtube.com slash user slash BMC software mainframe slash featured. That's it for this session. Thank you and see you next time.